Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this week, we show you how to get the Joan t-shirt or Joanne t-shirt. I don't have to pronounce that name. It's in two different games. You can actually get it. I'll be showing you the first way, which is when Row beats one of my least favorite event games. Not because the game is bad, just I feel like it's always hard, but this one was actually pretty easy. RB Battles really just, you know, made this one really hard, so not the best memories with this game, but it's not a bad game. It's actually really fun. You have to basically complete the song. It's about a two minute and a, it's like two minutes and a half song, speeding you up really quickly so you guys don't have to like sit through the whole time. You basically just try and get to a good like area and try to like get as far as you can to get better um, grades and I guess uh, you can call it for this game. Basically, just try to beat it. You don't really need to win. You just need to play the song. As you guys can see, I did really well. But yeah, I got a B plus for that. You will get the badge once you finish that. That's how you get the first shirt. They're the same exact item, by the way. So it won't give you two different shirts. There's just two different ways. This is the harder way to get it. More fun, but it's a little harder. If you guys want to see the easier way, let's go ahead and get to that game. So now that we're in this game, we're going to need to go over to the... It's like a noob attack or a noob simulator. So you need to go all the way over to the concert and just step on the pad to get it. I got it on the rock, so I'll get a badger at the bottom of my screen. Basically, how you get the t-shirt both ways. So, yeah, if this video was helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And don't forget to turn on post notifications, and I'll see you guys in the next one.